What is going on everybody today? We are back and today we're playing some more Mafia 1 Definitive Edition. L yesterday we, we, uh, it was a crazy episode. We did, we did a two, two episode vid yesterday because we were bored. We ended up killing Dom Morello and, uh, uh, Salieri. He, uh, ri he thought, he made us think that we were stealing diamonds when we ended up stealing dope. And then, uh, Polly wanted to rob a bank, so I think we're in on that. So I think we might be robbing a bank this episode. So yeah, let's get it. You turn me up when you fell. Alright. I can't wait. We're definitely getting near the end of, the, of this game. There's only like a thing. I probably only have like two more. Moonlighting, 1938. Grand Imperial Bank. Plan stays the same. Right. I take care of the crowd. You handle the manager. Threats don't work. Do what you gotta do. Keeps the vault keys on them. So you tell her sounds the alarm. How long do we get? Five minutes. Maybe more. Before the cops show. What if it all goes to hell? I'm not fucking around, Tom. You hear gunshots down at the vault? Don't come up. It's the money or nothing at all. Yep, we're definitely robbing a bank. You doing this? We're doing it. Stay where we can see your pretty faces. Anybody moves, I'll pop them. <laughs> okay, that's one way to start a thing. It's on one way to get into it. Movement, get the manager. Uh, how? How? Stairs, right here. Boom. With me. Down to the vault. Escort the manager at gunpoint. No one needs to get hurt. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck down there. It's make you feel big. Beating on a little guy. It's making me feel rich. <laughs> little guy gets to walk away if he doesn't do anything stupid. Um Paul, you good? How many guards at the vault? One. You gonna shoot? I don't know. If I see a gun, he gets a bullet. So you tell him to stand down. It's all on you. All right, I'll meet my mic. Everything okay? Manager here is being good and cooperative. We're all doing what we're told, aren't we, buddy? Keep moving. You won't get away with this. Your sword never do. You just worry about yourself. You want to see your daughter graduate from high no, school. I'm you keep your hands you. where I can see them and tell your guard to do the same. This guy is the slowest walker downstairs. Oh my god. Remember. Get to your guard, you tell him to drop his gun. You got that? I'm pretty sure you heard you from the fucking echo. Listen to me very carefully. I need you to put down your oh, single shit. Boy. Shoot him! I knew this was gonna happen. Deal with the guards. You're dead. There was three guards. 
dead. Get key from the manager. Yeah. Full keys on the table. No one else has to die. I don't have to die. I want to kill you so bad for doing that to me. Get into the vault. All right. Boom. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Wake him on it. Alright, let's go. It's time to go. What are we doing? Deal with the cops. Boom. 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 I want the Tommy gun. Escape the bank. Follow Polly. We only grabbed one thing of cash. Are you serious? Let's get it, boys. Go, go, go. Let's get it, let's get it, go, go, go. Get in the car. Let's go. Get in, Polly. Go, go, go! Where? Lose the cops. Alright, I'll see you guys when something happens. Where now? A Palermo club. Sam's club. Hey, it's empty right now. But you don't know, can't hurt him. Alright, we're driving to the Palermo club. We lost the cops. I'll see you guys when we get there. Done it. It's still almost falling. We'll only have done it once my heart stops trying to beat outside my chest. Alright, looks like we made it. Isn't this that same place where we killed that one person? That one girl in the way? No, it's not. Never mind. Boom. Alright. I 
I can't believe we fucking did it! We're loaded! We're loaded! Yeah. For all time's sake. Sure. Ah! We gotta go. I'll see you tomorrow. Unless I'm halfway to Hawaii. Oh, come on. I'm kidding. Hey, I couldn't have done this without you. I know that. Go home. Celebrate with Sarah. Come by my place in the morning. We'll split up the dough. Yeah, okay. Good luck. See you around, pal. <laughs> All right, mission complete, moonlighting. That last big score trophy earned. Okay, before we continue, I have a feeling Polly's gonna do something. He's either gonna skip town like Frank tried to do, get out of the life, or something along the lines of that, where he's not gonna give the money or something. Polly's gonna do something, or Salgari and Sam are gonna find out. But let's see what happens. I'm interested. <sighs> the Death of Art, 1938. Well, look at this. Christ has finally risen. I was getting ready to call the coroner. Sorry. Had a bit of trouble falling asleep this off. Me too. Thanks to you tossing and turning all night. Okay, what you do? We're just feeling lucky, is all. Got that right, champ. But I've been thinking. Oh yeah? I'll call the papers. I've been thinking about taking you and a kid out to the shore. You serious? Ain't you working? Uh, Polly and me, we've come into some money. Huh. One of his cracked angles finally pay off? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Pack a few bags. I'll swing by after I go around to Polly's. What ain't you telling me, Tommy? Nothing. Sure, you and Polly are suddenly flush, and now you want to leave town for a few days? That don't square. Well, what's the point of making a buck if we can't spend it? That ain't it. You're moving, even when you're standing still. Yeah, you're nervous about something. Ellie, you don't even know why yet. Well, that must be it. Well, you better figure it out before you get to Polly's, just in case it's him that got you all wound up. <laughs> Polly's all right. Don't worry about it. Well, I guess I'll see you soon. Meet Polly at his apartment. What's with the sad music? That's what I want to know. Uh, where's our car? Oh, this is our car? Okay. Quite the collection, trophy earned. All right, let's. Uh, I'll see you guys when we get to Polly's.
Alright, looks like we made it. I, I feel like something's gonna go wrong here. That's just my prediction, but I think something really is gonna go bad here. Let's see. This neighborhood's going to the dogs. What happened? Uh, upstairs. Uh, I've been working nights. Guy in the apartment above me was blazing hell. Oh, uh, this is his right here. Uh oh. Oh no! Jesus. Are you fucking ki I knew it! Bali. Bali. Oh, Fuck, dude. Why Paul? I bet you it was fucking Sam. I bet you it was Sam. Uh oh. Sam, it's me. It's Tom. Where's Polly? He's, uh... He's dead. I'm looking at him slumped over in a hallway, torn a fucking skull. Oh, God. I was... I was calling to warn him. About what? Jesus Christ. I owe you fellas my life three times over. Warn him about what, Sam? Salieri. He found out about the bank job. You're in deep shit, Tom. Fuck! Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, I just need some cash to get me and the girls out of town. Can you swing that? Sure. Anything, pal. Uh, you want me to come to Polly's? No. No, I can't stay here. Uh, meet me at the, the city gallery. Yeah, okay. Keep your head down, Tom. I'll uh, see you soon. And, uh... Thanks, Sam. It wasn't Sam. It was fucking Salieri. Polly's fucking dead, dude. And now we have to skip town because he knows about the fucking bank. Who told him? Polly. I gotta go. I'm sorry. Meet Sam at the city gallery. Hold on a second. Who the fuck? How did he find out? Sam must have told him then. He had to have told him. Because there was only three of us that knew. And we didn't tell him. And sure as shit, Polly didn't tell him. Oh my god. I had a feeling he was going to die. Oh, I'm mad. I'll see you guys when we get to City Gallery. I'm gonna call the cops. Something ain't right. Someone said it could have been gunshots. I just gotta say something. I knew we shouldn't have done the bank job. I had a feeling we shouldn't have did it, but... You know, it sucks that fucking Polly's dead. Uh, I'll see you guys when we get there.
All right, we made it. Sam, what the hell's going on? You and Polly you put me in a bad spot. I know, Sam, but I'm sorry about that, but I need to get out of town. Can you help me or not? There you go again. Making me choose between my friends and the family. This is what you were looking for at Polly's. Here's your cut. It's more than you deserve. Sam. You killed him. You killed Polly. Oh, are you fucking... Polly got himself killed. And you seem real tore off about it. I'm just in a good mood. Fuck when you. Things are right between me and the Don. I'm moving up. And I just found this big bag of money. The Don knows about Frank, Tom. The whore, too. That whore? The girl you were sweet on? You're the one that let her live. I'm sorry about this, Tom. But our business has rules. Shame, too. Don Salieri? Really liked you. Guess we'll both have a good cry at your funeral. You think you're doing this because you're loyal. But you're not. You're just scared. Maybe. But you would have lived a lot longer if you would have just looked over your shoulder from time to time. Goodbye. Don't let him suffer, boys. He's my buddy. Fuck you, Sam. Good. Good. We're fucking killing Sam. I don't care. Survive the ambush. Boom. You're dead. Sit down. Find go? Sam. Yeah, fuck you, Sam. Yeah? Fuck you. You're dead. I was Fuck shut the fuck up. He's going for me.
Boom. Boom. You're still all dying. Sit down. Everybody's dying. Come here, Sam. You're dead. Thank you. I just hit Sam twice. Get down, get down. Jesus. Boom. Boom. This is what happens when you fuck with me. Me and fucking Polly. You didn't Polly didn't deserve to fucking die. Kill Sam. Yeah. Sam, you're fucking fuck you, dead. Sam. Yeah, fuck you. I need to heal real quick. Celieri was ripping us off. Ripping you off, baby. See? I the ladies think smart. <sighs> How does that hit me? Come on. Really? I just killed almost the entire family. <laughs> Fuck you, Sam. <laughs> Fuck you. A lucky shot, Tom. But the thing about drug money is it pays for a lot of muscle. Put them down, boys. Get him before he gets me. 
Come here, Sam. Where the fuck is he? Come on, Sam. You, Sam, eat shit. Fuck you. Fucking backstabbing what piece of shit. The doctor this time, Sam. You kill me now in the dawn. She's never gonna stop looking for you. But you let me live. I'll tell Salieri you're dead. You can disappear. Just like Frank. Put a bullet in his fucking He's head. To stay gone. Right? What happened to him? He was hiding out in Europe. Oh. For <laughs> the dumb bastard. He started betting at the dog track. Oh. Got spotted by a friend of the family. So Salieri. He sent out a crew. And his family. Christ. <laughs> you can't do it, can you? you always that little voice in the back of your head. Maybe sounds like your baby girl, Sarah. Always telling you not to pull that trigger. And you can't make up your mind. It's getting easier every time you open your fucking mouth. <laughs> we sure had some laughs, right? Remember that time? Me, you, and Polly. <laughs> No remorse. Yeah, fuck you. Everybody's dead now. Sam's dead. Polly's dead. What the fuck are we supposed to do? That is sad. I sympathize with the situation, Tom, and I want to help your family, but... Friends of Family Trophy are a life of crime trophy and I can't do anything unless you're willing to testify in court. You understand that, right? You'll have to sit in that box, stare down Salieri, Ralphie, Vinny, maybe even Sarah's father. I... I don't know if you got the stones for it, if I'm being honest. I'll do what needs to be done. But you need to get my family new identities and ship them far away from here. Well, hold on. There's a long road between us sitting here bumping gums and Sarah sleeping under new stars. Then I'm sorry I wasted your time. And mine. I gotta get out of town. Look, Tom. I got a family too. Wife. Four boys. All Irish twins. Yeah.
so you know I understand what you're going through. All the worrying over them, the fear that one of them's gonna go before you do. But this case, it'll be one of the biggest this city has ever seen. It could drag on for years. I don't know if I can protect you for that long, not the way things are downtown. Everyone's gonna eat, right? Even dirty cops. Just being honest here, there's a few bodies I can trust downtown, but not many. And if it comes down to you or me taking a bullet, I'm not gonna make my wife a widow. Keeping you alive in exactly the moral course, but I'll try. That's a pretty good sales job. Trying to make me think you got nothing on the line. But this is your whole career right here. However it works out for me, whether I live or die, you get to crack the Morello case and take down a Don. Celieri will be your legacy. Don't go thinking you know me, Tom. Salieri belongs behind bars. I'll help you so long as you help me put him there. That's all this is. Then that has to be enough. Um, hold on. Epilogue. Actually, let's just do this. Okay, so we're at the wedding. 1951, so this is... A long time ago. Oh! That's us! Another life. And that's our daughter getting married. Someone once told me that family is a man's Achilles heel. His greatest weakness. Maybe Go to prison? Because everything I've done. Vinny and Ralphie. Both good and bad. I've done for my family. There's Sarah. My back There's Dawn. I thought were my friends. I've kept a lot of hard promises. Is that us? Yep. Totally alone. So we went to prison for eight years. I find myself so I could come home. A better husband. A better father. A better man. Now that I'm a lot older and just a bit wiser. <laughs> I see. This was 13 years later. Family is our greatest weakness. But it's also our greatest strength. It gets us out of bed in the morning. It lets us chase our dreams. Even when <gasps> we're moving too fast to catch. No! I remember this scene. This is from Mafia 2. Falling over. Oh, we're too tired. It's Vito! Mr. Angelo. It's Joe and Vito. Yes. Mr. Salieri sends his regards. Tommy! No. You're safe now. You're all safe. Remember <sighs> that money, jobs, even best pals will come and go. But family, family is forever. That was fucking Vito and Joe from Mafia 2. 
Is that it? That's the game, right? Oh, what a game. So that's who we played. So ba in Mafia 2, there's this mission where you go to this guy's house and you kill him. That was, so that guy is who we were this entire game. And that's how we died to Vito, the main character of Mafia. That's so cool. That speech at the end though, that was cool too. Doesn't matter, families forever. That was crazy. I really enjoyed this game. A lot of twists and turns. Hopefully you guys did too. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you guys in my next series. Peace out.